Hey YouTube, it's Elvis Ammo here. Hey, today I'm over here at the Woods Runner School and uh, I'm learning from Joshua Barnes how to be more self-reliant and probably you guys should too. Uh, today I'm going to show you my, my new camp here. This is my new home for the weekend. I'm over here at the Joshua Barnes Woods Runner School and uh, we're learning some survival skills the art of self-reliance and uh, I just thought I would take you guys along and uh, and kind of show you what I'm learning now this is my new home right here this is this is my house for the weekend right here now you can see that uh, that I have, uh, I, I am, I have protected it with signage. I am warning people not to mess around in Elvis Ammo's tent. So here we are. This is the Woods Runner School. I'm over here in the upstate of South Carolina, around Clinton, South Carolina, and uh, and this is our new camp. I'm just going to kind of give you a little scroll around and. And let you see all the riffraff that I'm dealing with over here. There's one of them right there walking by. And uh, this is our little camp area. And uh, we're, we're about to uh, enter into class. And I'll just kind of take you around here where the, where the class is. We got some more riffraff running around in the, in the background over here. Hey uh, YouTube, you guys are going to enjoy this. I'm going to give you a couple of little clips about what we're doing and things that we're learning. Important things that you need to survive in, a, in the wilderness and life skills that can help you in life. So I'm just going to kind of show you this little classroom setting real quick. And uh, you know we have a, a mix of folks in here from, from pretty much all around. And uh, this is our, uh, our classroom setting. I'm just gonna give you a little scroll around. Try not to make you too dizzy. It's right here, our, our executive, fine executive teacher. That's his, uh, that's his desk right there, probably, I'm pretty sure about. And uh, you know, this is our, uh, our fire pit. And, uh, you know, we got some cool stuff and some cool folks meeting a lot of cool people. And uh, we got some, uh, some cooks. I don't know if you can see in the background there's a fire. And they had made some fine SOS. And some of you guys already know what SOS is. So anyway, uh, I'll, uh, we'll... Uh, We'll learn something else here and I'll bring you guys back to kind of bring you along and, and just show you, you know, what we're learning. All right, here we go. We're gonna, I just need to show you what we're cooking over here uh, in, uh, in Joshua Barnes uh, survival course. <laughs> Teaching. Now uh, here, here's what we got going on here. We've got some, uh, We've got some frog legs going on over here. Yeah, got some frog legs right there cooking. And we have some uh, some rabbit right on the spit. We got rabbit going on right there cooking on the spit. And, uh, and then inside the bamboo right there we have some fish. And uh, and inside that tube right there of bamboo, we have rice cooking. And we got we're boiling some rice inside of the bamboo. I mean, we are just having a feast, you guys. Uh, look at those frog legs. Uh, they're not starting to jump yet, but they will as soon as they get hot. And uh, and over here, we've got the sausage going on, and we just took some bacon off. I mean, this is how we eat. We don't just survive, we thrive out here in uh, Joshua Barnes Woods Runner class. I just wanted to uh, update you guys 
on uh, on what we're doing here and what we're eating. We just learned how to uh, light these fires using char cloth and and uh, and other methods. And uh, I'll I'll uh, I'll update you guys and fill you in as uh, as we move on and do some more cool stuff. All right, guys. Last but not least, we got some fresh dove cooking on the fire. These things were we rounded these things up just this morning. We have some fresh dove. All right. So now we got the frog legs, the dove. We've got the uh, we've got the rice that cooked out of the bamboo. And uh, uh, what else we got over here? Block knife. And oh, the dove, and what else? What did we just take off? The frog legs? Yeah. And the rice. And the rice. And he's taking off the last of the hearts and the bacon. And uh, we're also building shelters. Now, this is a rather large one. This is a long term shelter. And uh, I'll let you see it uh, as we go and what it looks like when we're finished. This is Joshua Barnes from the Woods Runner School. And Joshua, tell us how to get a hold of you if okay. someone wants to come to this class or interested in okay. coming to this class. And just tell them real quick about, you know, some of the things that you teach here and why. Okay. Let's Mr. Elvis here from Elvis Elbow had to tell you guys. I'm Joshua Bars. I'm the, the founder and lead instructor here at the Woodrunner School. We're located here in Clinton, South Carolina. If you guys want to attend, you can either find me on Facebook at the Woodrunner School of Self Reliance, or you can also find, find me via telephone 864 871 6223. That's 864 871 6223. To tell you a little bit about the school, the school was developed, the curriculum was developed to not just teach people how to to make it through a 72 hour crisis scenario. What we do, we want to take you not just one, two, or three steps further, but take you through a long path of sustainable living within the wilderness. If you guys can look up and see what the word woods runners defined as, is a man or a woman who can make their living and actually be able to live within the woods. There's so many a plethora of, of, of resources here within the woods that you can use, and that's the thing, we want to introduce you to those things. So that's what we have to offer here. We have numerous different um, courses. We have an intermediate course. We're working on an advanced course now and we're also going into a woodrunner course which you can apply all of your skill sets. We're going to come out, we're going to hunt, we're going to fish, we're going to be able to, to tan hides, we'll be able to use the whole entire animals and things that we that we catch to be able to press forward. And also, you guys, if you'll get on Facebook and check us out, we have numerous workshops that are one day workshops. Sometimes during the summer months we have them during the week and also Oh, a lot of Saturday. So you guys just give us a give us a look and give us a shot if you want to attend. And we appreciate having having um, Elvis from Elvis Elbow out here with us this weekend. Um, so we had a good time, and uh, we finished that hut. And I just wanted you to take a, a look at that. And I was just going to also kind of let you take a a glance around at uh, at my point of view without making you too dizzy. It's a uh, you know pretty pretty dense forest. Right there's the uh, the hut. So uh, here's the uh, here's the finished product. Last weekend at his at Jake before then, and uh, I have one more at uh, Eugene the rodeo quail. So pretty cool. And that's more of a long-term shelter. There we go. I'll just kind of give you a look around the woods. There's some riffraff right there. <laughs> so this is uh, this is the art of self-reliance. Woods Runner School. We just really had an excellent time. And I just wanted to bring you along and just show you, give you a, a few clips of of what we did. I'm gonna give you a shot at the backside of this place. Thing is 
Oh, yeah. You don't want to be bad. How long, yeah. how long can you live without air? That's right. How long can you live without... $5,000 and get a beach on. So I built stronger relationships with some of the friends that I met at the school and um, and I also made new friends from some of the people that some of the new people that I met that was at the school and I even met the spokesperson for yes Sasquatch Bigfoot Southeast Division I cannot make this up and uh, I'll have uh, special thanks in the notes in the description and a link uh, for you to be able to reach Joshua Barnes at the Woods Runner School and uh, I just wanted to say that all of these things that I've learned are still just now sinking in you know from deadfall traps to snares to finding wild edibles in the woods and uh, and building shelters and fire and those kind of things that are just so important to us YouTube I hope you enjoyed this self-reliance segment God bless <laughs>